Hi, hi, hi guys. I finally found a way to storage my blankets and stuff and like my sheets and my comforters. The other day I was digging through my tote. It was so hard for me to like get to the bottom of the tote because everything was on top of it and whatnot and it's like all mixed up with like the pillowcases and sheets. I've been having that issue for like the longest. Recently I had the idea to get a dresser for Leona's room. I usually keep all her toys in a dresser and so I was thinking like maybe I could just use that idea for my beddings and stuff. Last week I ordered a plastic white dresser from Walmart and these blue totes which I will like show you guys um, in a little bit. I don't know what to tell you guys but it's such a good idea if you are looking for ways to storage your like bed sheets hopefully this will help you because it definitely helped me make a lot more room in the guest room I will show you guys how I was organizing them and how I was able to make use of the totes I, I kid you not like I have so much more room and it's like everything is like so organized now I feel like whenever I do laundry it's a lot easier to sort everything out so like when I'm folding the pillowcases I can just throw them in like their own little section and then when I'm doing the fitted sheets then they go in their own little section you guys will know what I'm talking about in a little bit okay so we're in Leona's room right now but I still wanted to show you guys um that I got these drawers also at Walmart because I'm going to be using them to put in my bed sheets and stuff and pillowcases so I might just the top might be for pillowcases and then the middle is for bed sheets and then like the flat sheets will probably go down here I bought these blue totes that I'm going to put my comforters in so that way I can stay organized. Now, when I order these, I definitely did not know that they were gonna be this big, but they are freaking huge. I'll show you guys how I storage and how I'm gonna organize them. I have my pillowcases in here all folded up and then the bed sheets that I tied give me one right now give me one, give me one, give me one and then the flat sheets here I actually kind of like this idea because it's a lot easier to organize I mean, and find when I'm like changing out my sheets so cool, I love it alright, and then I'm gonna go ahead and start filling up these big totes up with uh, my comforters. Let me know how you storage your bedding stuff and like your comforters. What do you do with them? Do not mind my hair today. I just did not want to touch my hair. So I just have it in like a messy high ponytail, I guess. And then I just have like bobby pins clipped. 
to hold like my bangs and what i'm wearing today i have my brother's four thumbs shirt on i always wear it i have like two three actually and i always wear mats so i have like three of these shirts they're really comfy I don't know, it's probably just the fabric. Then I just have like my non-matching booty shorts on. <laughs> That's what you do when you're at home, right? You just wear mismatching clothes. That's why I don't really do like outfit of the day. I'm always like bumming out at home. Um, the only thing I really care about is like my face, you know? And sometimes my hair, but today I just didn't really care for it. This morning, me and Leona woke up so early i felt like it was really good i need to wake up early like this all the time i woke up at like five o'clock today just because i couldn't sleep last night it was so weird i had like the weirdest dream no it wasn't like those cheating dreams or anything like that i'm just gonna stop blabbering i talk too much and i try not to talk a lot yeah i think that's i think that's all i have to say for this morning yikes so Leona is going to be eating these purple jelly. Mama, they look like I want to eat this. Mommy, I want to eat jelly. I know you are. I'm putting it all in the bowl for her so it'll be easy for her to just pick up and eat it. Mommy, eat it. Hold on. Mommy got to open it for you. I want to eat jelly. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's jelly. It tastes jelly. It's like jelly. Jello. I got it for my jello. Oh, what color? What color is this? Yellow. Good job. What color is this? Pink. Good job. What color is this? What color? <laughs> What's the magic password? Jello. This is Leona's Jello. Let's see how fast she devours. Leona. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm Show them, show them, show them how you eat. All done? Can you show them your bowl? Show them your bowl. That, show them that you're here that you. It is actually... Oops. Let me just like delete some of my notifications here. Before I show you guys the time. It is 2.09 right now. I am going to make lunch slash dinner for Matt. So that when he comes home, he has something to eat. And if you do watch my videos, like you know that sometimes I would cook food or like cook dinner for Matt before he gets home. If you want to watch me make the white bass soup, then go ahead and just continue watching. I obviously would love it if you guys continue watching.
So Matt is going to take us to Cabela's today to go get me a fishing pole. I can't. Ooh, you can see the back of my. Ooh. <laughs> I just, I just like freaking like embarrassed myself. Matt is going to take us to Cabela's to get me a fishing pole because we're going fishing this weekend. I will be vlogging our fishing trip. You guys will see that in the next video or maybe like the next two videos that I have coming up for you guys. I think I'm gonna wrap everything here. If you like this video, I know it was just like a very quick vlog today. If you guys like this video, then give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and click that notification bell so that you know when I upload, okay? And I will see you guys in my next video.